Hi, my name is Nathan Brisby. Welcome. We created this intensive companioning in the workplace in response to a fairly simple idea about the workplace. And that is that for most of us, the workplace is a profane space where the sacred is not welcome. And as a result, our workplaces are often the places where we feel most disconnected, most dehumanized, most misunderstood. But one of the major unfoldings as we move into this post-COVID time is that the world of work is changing and workers are no longer satisfied with workplaces that don't welcome their full humanity, which includes their spirituality and the fullness of their spirituality. We've also noticed that as spiritual companions, lots of our conversations have started to really unfold in new ways about people's relationships to their own purpose and their purpose in their workplaces. And so people are thinking more and more deeply about their purpose professionally, which I would contend is one of the main reasons for people leaving their jobs in mass, AKA the great resignation. So in response, a lot of forward thinking organizations are accepting and integrating spirituality into their workplaces in ways that are formal and informal. Now, most spiritual companions believe that they have the tools to navigate the workplace dynamics at play, even though very few, if any, companionship programs talk specifically about the elements of the workplace or how to navigate those workplace systems. Even more specifically, very few programs talk about how to decolonize our relationship with a workplace that was built on principles of colonization. So if we don't have that kind of training, even with our best intentions, we do risk doing some harm. And so this intensive is a kind of continuing education that's about providing a framework for companioning within the workplace so that we can help birth a new world of work that includes powerful, skillful, and gentle presences of the sacred. We hope you'll join us.